symptoms of thyroid so the symptoms of thyroid if i have to say hypothyroid which is one of the most common okay today when i see you know 10 i would say 10 obese people out of that you know at least eight of them have hypothyroidism okay it's become so common but what is really more alarming so 40% of indian women have hypothyroidism but what is really more alarming is you know today the at the age of 8 9 years old children also they have uh, they show symptoms of thyroid which is really alarming okay and what are the symptoms the symptoms of hypothyroidism uh, thyroidism is you know weight gain mainly in women there is a lot of uh, weight gain okay sudden spurt of weight gain obesity fatigue uh, they feel tired all the time their depression you know depression is one of the major cause and people cannot relate depression with thyroidism which is so important because they they actually do not believe that you know thyroidism can cause depression right another very major factor is you know irregular periods people treat irregular periods but they fail to treat the thyroid itself if detected okay so uh, hypothyroidism uh, you know gives you muscle cramps and aches and sudden weight gain so um, this these are few symptoms of hypothyroidism so, okay now hyper in this you suddenly lose weight and weight people get very happy are acha hua hyperthyroidism <laughs> losing weight but honestly it's it's not fat loss it's protein it's muscle loss which gives you muscle ache cramps your heart rate increases you sweat a lot so there's tachycardia there is acidity okay there's a lot of restlessness and anxiety with people actually encounter there are skin changes discoloration patches hair fall brittle hair uh, brittle nails so these are the kind of uh, symptoms that one exhibits when one has hypo or hyperthyroid okay and well differentiated <laughs> yeah which is so important because gadbad ho jati hai nevertheless they have to consult the doctor but generally this thyroid should you know or rather what i have seen is starts during uh, the delivery of the second child or after the delivery of the second child okay or in like in the mid 30s but what we see today is really really uh, their people exhibit the symptoms much earlier okay so uh,